between us isn't that in a way i mean i know the situation was quite different right that i mean abs cbn um the 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 franchise was was about to lapse and it was asking for a renewal and you still have a franchise but you telling me now on head start we demand an impartial court we demand did abs cbn have an impartial court frankly speaking didn't didn't smni agree at that point that congress has the right to give a franchise and revoke a franchise aren't you sitting where we were sitting frankly before uh, now frankly, you're faced frankly, with, frankly wait now you are faced with a jury that is not impartial imagine what a mainstream network had to go through it's the same actually uh with all due respect miss karen it's not the same why because so it, i said the situation uh, wasn't the same right but in the end congress stands by their power that they have the jurisdiction to renew or revoke a franchise do you, you know, agree uh, with that but do you agree that they do congress we say congress is the house of representatives yes the house of absolutely so the do you agree that the house do you agree that they do that's the first question we say the house is the house of senate and the house of congress but if the franchise is still valid and existing it is like a proper proper uh, property rights we say property right it is protected by the due process clause of the constitution we agree that the franchise is not a right but it is a privilege but once it is granted by the by the congress and approved by the president it is like a property right that needs to be protected under the due process clause of our constitution so in this case right. the ntc but, but that's action, not that's not what some congressmen believe i've spoken why. to them and they believe that congress has the exclusive right to revoke a franchise we say congress that's within their rights that is their right if it is uh, if we apply for a renewal but in this case this is valid and existing it is considered as a proprietary right protected by the due process clause of our constitution nakalagay po yan sa ating ju uh, jurisprudence with Karen yes a franchise is a privilege not a right but once it is granted by congress meaning the house of senate and the house of congress uh, house of representative and approved by the president it is considered as a proprietary right that that should be protected by the due process clause of our constitution okay now that that's a point of view but that's an argument you're making that technically if you have a franchise you can bring it to court right that it can uh, be revoked right just and like second, that. and second miss karen the ntc's decision is based only of a resolution from the house of representative so it is not a law because we say franchise that is the discretion and power of the house of senate and the house of representative not just the house of representative so they need a confirmation from the house of senate and still there is no no confirmation yet it's just a resolution from the house of representative and don't forget under the separation of power the, wait, wait the NTC what, what, no 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 the ntc are you trying to say that the ntc still needs a senate concurrence no no i'm i'm talking of the legislative franchise legislative okay. franchise is the discretion and the jurisdiction of yes, the house, but, of, but we're not and yet the house there. of congress yes but we're not yet there you're moving in advance right we're we're, we're not yet there okay we're not yet there when you talk about congress having the sole power to revoke do you agree with that what you're saying is no you're saying it can go to the courts because now it is proprietary that's your argument yes, so we still have to see if, if they, they want to amend it if they want to revoke it they need another law not just from the resolution or a committee report from the house of representative they need a law we say a law approved by the house of representative and approved by the house of senate and approved by the president of the philippines okay not, not just right. a mini resolution no so now you're saying they need an amending law yes that's it right okay but that's your point of view it may not necessarily be another lawmaker's point of view but